Well, good morning, everybody. Oh my god, I love soccer beer! Yay! Oh, this is a special one. I've been waiting for actually. If I have been waiting for this one, but this is my second baby from this artist. Although the first one has not arrived yet, but that's okay. Um, when you see her, you will know. Hopefully, you will know who her artist is. Um, and I'll explain something about this baby. How there was a bit of kerfuffle with it, and I'll explain that. Oh my God. This is a new up and coming artist. Um, and if you know who I'm talking about, you know who I'm talking about. Box opening. Oh, in the background, before I go, start that, is some of my babies who I am taking on my holiday. I've got Joy, Ashley, Lee, Brick, and Garfield. They're ones who have never been on a holiday with me. None of them. So that's, they're the ones who I'm taking on my holiday. Now to this exciting bow box opening. Oh my God. This young artist is, I think she's going to go far. Mm. I've unzucked it. As you can see, it's come, where are we? See where it's come from? United States Postal Service. So that might be a hint as to who this baby could be. <laughs> See? That's the baby. Oh my god, she is That's it. She is a tiny one. She is a tiny one. Oh, in such a big box. I can't get any closer before I unwrap her. As I said, there's a bit of kerfuffle about this. And, yeah. Got a pink blanket. Oh. oh. Isn't she tiny and light? Look at it. Oh. Let's see. Nice pink blanket, so it makes she's a little girl. Oh my god. I cannot wait to see this artist's work. Oh my goodness. Look at those tiny feet. Look at those tiny feet. Oh my god. If he can you see? Who the artist is, just by that. If you follow this artist, not her, but someone else, you will see who the artist was. And when I, it was, I got, I got a fee bag, and I didn't realise when I won that I actually got this little car seat with it. My God, she's so tiny. Oh my God, look at her. Whatever. She's only got a little bottle. Oh, I have got. Oh my god, this. This is. Oh, I have to bring this down a bit. I d you know, when you get babies, you say, okay, they're this size. You don't really. Think about the size. You don't. You can't envision the size until you actually get it, and you think, "Oh my goodness!" So, does anybody know who this baby is? Not who the baby is, but who her artist is. Can you tell? How many can say now that this is the artist for this little baby? Oh my God, I don't want to open it. <laughs> I just want to stay here and capture the moment. Oh, look, she got it. Oh, so she will be coming on my holiday with me. Um, 
as I said, this is a, my second baby from this artist. I've already, I've already, I actually haven't, as I said, I actually haven't received the other baby yet. But then I'll explain that when soon. Um, but I've already named the other baby, but um, I think I've got an idea what I'm going to call this baby. I just, not the full name, but the, I might shorten it. Um, I've just got to think about it. This is. Oh my god um, I'll see if I can get closer because she's so tiny oh how many of you know who I'm talking about how many know that who the artist is hey come on oh you know sometimes I feel so privileged that I'll be enabled to buy my babies and especially when I get them from oh my god I think this is that the third the third baby that this like artist has created that they're all been tiny ones but she has had a bigger one up on eBay lately and oh, I'm not in the big one I'm getting into tiny ones now I'm even looking at kits to buy so that I can find someone to actually do them for me. Look at that. And it feels like, oh. I think it's time we unveil our eh, girls and boy. Yeah. You're all excitedly waiting there to see your new little sister. Oh, my God. This is, this artist has actually, as I said, I think this was her third baby she created and I've actually got two of hers. Now, as I said, the other one's still coming. It's on its way. Hopefully it wait, will wait until I, here we go. Oh my God. Look at that little baby. Look at the little baby. Now, I'll, I can, if you don't know already, I will tell that the artist of this baby, the artist is Tambri Ortiz, Ortiz, which is Stephanie's from In Love of Reborn 2011. This is her daughter created this. Um, if you have been following Stephanie's channel, you know there was a bit of, bit of drama with this baby on eBay. And I'll explain to you that, yes, I was one of the ones involved with the drama, but it, my, if you had seen the channel on Stephanie, you'll see that someone had made a bid then realised it was a big one. I mean, a real, it was a like 5,000 bid and emailed her well that was me i do not know how i that bid came about um there was not even no confirmation that i actually had bidded that amount it just came up bang and as soon as i realized that i did contact stephanie and of course she was asleep i don't know of course as i've said i'm in australia and she's in California in the States. And of course she was asleep. Um, and because there was another person. Because my bidding, my buying rate on eBay is 100%. Um, I, I have sold some things years ago. Um, but my buy my buying on eBay is the one hundred percent. As soon as I buy something, bang, it's paid for. Um, I was, as I said, my bid was I think ended up to be five thousand four hundred. Um, and I did contact Stephanie, and I was outbid. <laughs> oh, someone outbid me, and the person who outbid me had zero feedback. 
And that is where it, all the drama came about. But when I told Ste let Stephanie, she said that when she got back, she said that she couldn't stop anything. She had to wait until it over. Then she relisted it. And I want him, I want her. Um, I, as I said, I didn't know this was coming with her. Because I'm pretty sure in the first bit, in the first one, the first auction for her, um, she wasn't, it wasn't going to be included. How do we get you out of here, little one? Look it up. Um, oh my God, she's tiny. I think she's a nine inch. Look at her. I think little tambourine. Oh, she even got an up here. Little tambourine. She's smaller than my my other kit. I think tambourine is going to be a good artist. Look at that. Oh my god, she is so tiny. Um The one thing I was weird about is that with this one I actually had to pay import taxes on this little one. Um but on the other one, the other one I'm getting, little one, is also from Tambury, which was the second one. And there is a reason why she hasn't arrived yet. I won't tell you. I have, actually have named that baby. I thought she's already got a name. Look at the hair. Is it watching Stephanie? And you've seen these bids on eBay. Stephanie has been overseeing this, her art, her work. Oh my God, she is so tiny. Look at her. My goodness. Oh. She's got three quarter arms. Oh my God. And four legs. Um. I can't remember what kit she is. I know one of the ones um, Tambry did was, um, I think, Marley. Another one was Beck. Becca. This might be Becca, but that's not her name. The name I am going to give her is, what are we going to call you? Aim? Eh? Um, I am going to call you, since I know Tambry's second name, I don't know, when I call you that, no, it's too big, you, you need a, you need a little name, she needs a little name, doesn't she, look at her, she is, oh my god, look at her, look at that face, You see that shaking? That's my tremors, my essential tremors that is doing that. And of course, my left hand is my dominant hand. I'm a left-hander. That is the worst. My head shakes, my knees, if I'm sitting relaxed, my legs will shake. My whole body shakes. And it's gradually getting worse. But, oh, look at that. Oh. Oh, my God. So, we'll do a shout out for Tambry. Keep a look out if you want a baby from Tambry. Keep a look out on eBay. Keep, um, 
keep a look out in Stephanie's channels because she always has links up on her videos when she's got new babies coming up. Um, I put it down because my shaking's getting worse. And look at the, she got her own little bed. Oh, isn't she sweet? I have come actually come up. Her name has come to me. Um, I move the elephant forward. There. Her name has come to me. I'll be calling her. Hmm. It's either two names. Let me see. Do you want to be Liz or do you want to be Beth? Um, no, not Beth. I had a friend years ago, her name was Beth, and I didn't like it. I might call her Liz. No, it doesn't. I don't like that name either. I don't know. The problem is, I do like the name Beth. What do you reckon, little one? We call you Beth? Yes. Okay, we want, I would like you to welcome little Beth to my home. She, her artist is Tambri Ortez. I think she's going by Ortez, yes. As you know, it's Stephanie's, Stephanie's daughter. Um, oh. So now you know, if you had seen the video where Stephanie explained about the big hoo-ha on eBay that I was one of the ones who bidded. I do not know how that bidding came about. I do not know how it happened. But I got this little one. Um, I won't be, from now, um, I won't be getting any more babies from Stephanie off eBay because of the import tax that is now being added onto them. Um, which is, mm, I'll explain that as, in Australia, when we get things coming from overseas in Australia, there is a thing called customs tax, import duty tax, customs, customs tax. But that's only uh, when you spend over $1,000. This baby was not $1,000. But the other one's coming. I did not have to pay import tax on it. So unless... It's a baby I really want. Um, I'm sorry if Stephanie's watching. Um, it's. I think I should just let you know that coming to Australia, there is now import taxes. And this little baby took a while to get here because she went via Honolulu. <laughs> she went on a trip to Honolulu, which is, I reckon... Really weird, because the other one's not going by a Honolulu. The other one's in San Francisco at the moment. Um, but that parcel coming is actually two babies in it, one from Tambry and another one from Stephanie. So that is why that one had been delayed, because she's sending it with one of the babies I got from her, from Stephanie. So that's why that one's been delayed, but I'm okay with that because I know Stephanie is a very busy lady. She's working hard and she's working especially around Angel. Um, now she's working for the doll show. What's this, April, May, June? In a couple of months, she's working to get babies up and going for that. So for the Rose Doll Show. I would love to, the one thing I would love is actually have a lesson with Stephanie to create a baby. Because this is amazing. I think with my shaking, it would be, <laughs> I don't know how that will go. I don't know how. So, everybody, welcome my new baby into my, my 
family. This is little Beth. She will be going on holidays with me when I leave Wednesday. I'm actually packing packing part today. I've already started packing. Um, I have. I did my washing on Friday night and it's been raining, but now it's fine. So I've actually got it out on the line so it'll get dry. The sunshine. Isn't that cute? Look at her. So she got her own bed when she goes away. Look at that. And a toy. And her own blanket. I've got to find one of these for my other baby when she arrives. Oh. Don't move. Look. Look at her. Don't move. My babies are good babies. And they're the ones I'm taking with me on holiday. I've got to organise what clothes to take. Um, she's, she's a newborn size. These are um, primies. Oh, this is a little leaf. And little brick and Garfield. They are, they are. They go together like chalk and cheese. They're good mates. I turn this around. Yes, I'm still in my nighty. As I said, it's Monday. It's about ten. It's after ten o'clock. I was up at ten o'clock, nine o'clock. Had the alarm going. Alarm set off. Oh, get this, get this little baby out. Look at that. As I said, look at that. I think this one is a Becca. I'm pretty sure this one is a Becca. Now I've got to get close for her. This is all she's got. What are we going to do? I have no idea what I'm going to do with clothes for you. You're smaller than Alice. Alice is the Byron kit. So she is Beth is smaller than Alice. Um, yes, so now you know who the one of the people was who's bidding on this baby and there was a mix-up and yes, I did the boo-boo first but I, the other person who continued to bid and bid and bid to outbid me had no feedback. Um, that is crazy and if you look at Stephanie's eBay auctions you'll see that you've got to have a certain amount of feedback before you can bid otherwise she will block you she'll cancel the bid whatever which is understandable you got no feedback on her on her auctions you don't get a chance unless you contact stephanie unless stephanie knows you unless you're um a patreon and you want the baby of hers and you just new signed to eBay and you got no feedback, then you let Stephanie know that you are on eBay and who you are. Otherwise, sorry girls and guys, if you got very few feedback, I think it's five positive feedback, don't even bother think, bidding on any of Stephanie's babies unless you contact her first. Unless you can prove that you're actually going to buy the baby. That is the whole thing. It is, Stephanie did um, explain that putting just one of these babies up on eBay takes her two hours. That in taking the photos and putting everything up, it takes two hours. Because the photos, she does beautiful photos of her babies on eBay. And yeah. Oh, I wonder. I was looking at um, Tambry's boyfriend. He actually had a baby up there. He's learning. But as I said, I'm not into big babies. I've got all my big babies. I like them little babies. Um, there's less room. Less room. Although there are some babies. Oh! I was looking at some babies on Facebook and I had them saved. I've had looked at for a couple of months because I know up your Tweed Heads area, Gold Coast area, and of course I'm heading up there. 
I'll see if I said if they are still there when I go up there they know they were to be mine if they're gone they weren't meant to be well both of them are gone actually one of them I had a good better, better look at and I didn't really like the hair and everything but the other one is gone sold so it wasn't meant to be mine maybe because they know I'm getting the little ones look at this she'll be able little Beth will be able to sit on the front seat in her bassinet I will have to strap her in yeah the other ones will lay on the back seat hopefully the car I'll get I can put the pram in the back seat so yeah <sighs> I'm feeling good um I think I've done for, I've done if I've uploaded the video I actually got some tea which helps you to relax so you can sleep of a bit better get to bed and I think that is working I mean I do sleep um I I don't have it just before I go to bed I have it maybe half an hour an hour before I go to bed and I do find myself getting relaxed and ready for bed and and I've had the crying that I usually have when I get up and decide okay at bedtime the last couple of nights it hasn't been there but I will keep an eye on that um it's a natural tea um I just put a a heat teaspoon into 500 mils of hot water and let it see for about 10 minutes then I drink that slowly because it's hot um, I don't really need to drink the whole lot really I drink as much as I can um, much as I'm able because that, then I put the rest in the fridge and if I wake up during the night I'll have that but if I do wake up during the night, I go to the toilet, I come back to bed, and I'm back to sleep again. I mean, it had started to work, and it's really good. Well, this morning I would wake at nine because my ba my baby, I knew this little baby was coming, and she is a sweetie. Look at her. I'll be able to take her in my handbag. Oh, look at her. She's a tiny one. Well, I think I should go. I've got to do some bit of cleaning up. I've got to organise baby, baby's clothes for our holiday. Um, I'm, I don't think there'll be another video before I go away. Um, I actually had my tripod packed away <laughs> because I thought I was expecting this tomorrow and I was going to do the box opening at Pickering. You got a nappy on. <laughs> so no more videos. Um, um, I might like do the videos up my holiday videos when I come home. So there'll be a week over a week before I upload any more videos. I've still got another couple to upload. I will upload. I'll I'll do this and I'll upload it. But I think they've got another couple to upload. I'll do those either tonight or tomorrow and tomorrow night, and that'll be it until I return. I. I'll, as I said, I'll leave Wednesday afternoon. I'll be back on the 26th of April, which in Australia, that is Anzac Day. That is where we remember the fallen, for all those who have gone before, who have fought for our country. Anzac stands for Australia, Australia New Zealand Army Corps. Um, I think that's what it is. It's, it's all those who have been to war, whether it been the First War, the Second War, Vietnam, any any soldier who has been to war and especially for those who went to war and sadly did not return we remember them on the 25th of april um yeah it's people say we do it the glory it's not to glorify war it is to remember those who fought for our country um i know america has one also Correct me if I'm wrong, I think it's called, is it Veterans Day in America? I think that's what it is. It, it's the same thing. We remember those who had fought for us, for our freedom. Um, and at the moment, with everything going on in, in this world, we, it is sad. Um, I don't believe in war. I think there's no reason for war. If 
Our country leaders decide, okay, we want to send our soldiers off the wall. Don't. Our leaders, would you please go and use fight? Yeah, that's what I agree. Our leaders should go and they should be the ones who should fight each other instead of sending off the young guys who may not come back. It is sad that they send all these young people off. I know they're proud to fight for their country. It's, yeah, um, I have never known anyone who has, actually, my great uncle Vic, he was in the Second World War. Uh, my dear friend Sarge, who passed away about six years ago, he was in Vietnam War. Uh, my great grandfather, he was in the First World War. So I do have known people who have actually fought in the war. But the sad thing is, when the, the veterans from Vietnam came, returned home, there was no welcome parade. There was nothing. Um, I don't remember the Vietnam War. I do not remember it. But it's sad that they went there because they were told to go. You've got to go and fight for your country. You've got to go and fight this. I thought, it is crazy. Absolutely crazy. In Australia, because we are a country, we have got no one other countries are joined to us it's just us we haven't fought with any other country with or we do fight within ourselves you know people fight and all this but it's not like a war um i know americans you had the civil war now that is i'm not no i wasn't going i was going to say it is but how can you have a civil war when you're going to be civil to people that you call it a civil war mm. any war is not good Okay, I'll get off my high horse. I will stop talking about wars because they aren't good. And to anyone out there who has got someone who has fought in any war, who has who was in fight, who's in now, who is deployed somewhere because of war, thank you for. I pray, I hope nothing happens. I hope. The, I hope and pray that they come home safely because when they deployed, they never know. It's just, it's not right. I don't believe in war. I do not believe in war. But I do believe in remembering those who have gone on. Because a lot of young guys, they lied about their age to get, so they could go and fight for their country. They wanted to fight for their country. I know I had a nephew years ago. He was going to join one of the services. Um, but then a war broke out, I think, in the Franklin. Is it Franklin's War or somewhere? And his mother wouldn't let him. He decided, he decided, no, I'm not going to. I can remember, I'm pretty sure the Franklin's War. I can remember that. I'm going back, well, I'm going back a long time. I can remember I was driving through Surface Paradise on the Gold Coast and it came on that. They had started bombing. I just started crying because I had never known of a war before. Yes, I had been alive through the Vietnam War, but I wasn't made aware of the. It wasn't something that I made aware of, you know. Um, like other countries, like Americas, and that when I was, I was only young. There's a lot of things I don't remember. Maybe good. So I think I might go. This video is getting a bit long. As I said, I'd like you to welcome little Beth to my family. I think Beth, 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 Beth. I got the wrong teeth in. Beth suits her better than Liz. Yeah, I think it does. I don't like Liz. I do like Liz, but but then again, I got two Lizzie kits, so it could get confusing. So this is little Beth. So. So we will go, I'll edit this video, hopefully there's no rain, hopefully the clothes will dry so I can pack them all away and we will see you when I see you, which unless something happens, I won't be doing a video, un uploading a video until I come back. I will probably upload this before the ones I've got online. I'm not, I'm, as I'm editing this one, I might actually, um, actually upload one of the other ones I've got because I think I've got a couple one or two to upload
yes i'll do that okay i'll see you in my next video whenever that will be no more videos unless it's an emergency video unless something happens otherwise i will see you i am on as i said i'm back on the 25th of april i will have to start i'll edit the videos while i'm away because i'm taking my laptop with me um so i'll be able to edit it fix them up and ready to upload for when i get home and we will see you then. I hope you have enjoyed my channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, welcome to this crazy channel. The world is crazy. It's okay to be crazy. Um, I hope you have enjoyed my videos. If you enjoy any of my videos, just give me the thumbs up. That helps the channel. Um, I found it helps the channel because it pops it up in the in the search engine or something like that. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. And as I've said before, if you are a reborn channel and you subscribe to my channel, I will take it back to you. I will subscribe to yours. Um, I have actually got a new one. I have she subscribed. Welcome to my channel. I have been on looked at your videos, and you've only a new new one, so that's okay. It takes a while to actually get into doing it, so. One thing I found the best thing to do was actually get a tripod. Um, another thing I find a bit iffy is when people have the portrait video and going up and down like that. I've like a landscape scene so much better. Um, otherwise, you got the black strips down each side. That's just me. Yeah, so I think I should go. This is getting a bit long for a box opening. So I will see you when I come back from my holidays and enjoy yourself. Look after yourself and enjoy your world. I will see you when I see you. And what do I always say? Have a good day, mate. Bye. <laughs>